Hi, everyone. Welcome to the latest episode of Hero Spotlight, featuring Julian, the fourth member of the Forsaken Light Quad. By casting his skills in different sequences, Julian can enhance one of his three skills to handle almost any situation on the battlefield. Hero Skills. First skill, Scythe. Scythe is Julian's primary harassing tool. Julian hurls a flying scythe in the target direction, dealing damage to enemies in its path and slowing them. Enhanced Burst Skill Enhanced Scythe Enhanced Scythe offers the highest burst damage. Julian hurls two flying scythes in the target direction that stop upon hitting an enemy hero or creep, dealing continuous damage to enemies in the area. Second Skill Sword Sword is Julian's mobility skill. Julian summons a flying sword and dashes in the target direction, dealing damage to enemies along the way. Enhanced second skill. Enhanced sword. Enhanced sword allows Julian to get away from even the direst situation in battle. Julian summons a large number of flying swords and briefly disappears, dealing continuous damage to enemies in an area. He's invincible during this process and will reappear in the distance after a short while. Third skill, Chain. Julian casts chains at the target location, dealing damage to enemies hit and immobilizing them. Enhanced third skill, Enhanced Chain. Julian casts Enhanced Chains at the target location, dealing continuous damage to enemies in the area and slowing them down. Enemies that remain in the area after a while are knocked airborne. Passive. Smith's Legacy. After two different skill casts, Julian's next skill is Enhanced. Casting the Enhanced skill makes all his skills go on cooldown but empowers his subsequent basic attacks for a period of time. Enemies hit by the empowered basic attacks will be pulled toward Julian. Pro Tips Pro Tip number one. Scythe can pass through minions. Use this skill during the laning phase to clear waves while harassing your laning opponent. Pro Tip number two. Your basic attacks are empowered after casting Enhanced Chain. Make use of the pull effect from the empowered basic attacks to keep the enemies within the knock-up zone. Skill Combos Laning Phase During the laning phase, cast Sword to get close to your laning opponent, then Chain to immobilize them, and finally Enhance Scythe for damage. You may also aim for kills with this combo when you're against squishy victims. Team Fight Number 1 In team fights, cast Scythe from a distance to add a stack of extra magic lifesteal, then Sword to go in. Cast Enhanced Chain at the location with the most enemies for maximized crowd control. Then spam the empowered basic attacks to dish out more damage and heal yourself. Team Fight Number 2 When targeted in team fights, cast Scythe to slow the enemy then chain to immobilize them, and finally enhance sword to get away. The damage dealt by the summoned swords may also provide decent HP regen. Tactics Early to mid game, Julian has three skills at level three, while most heroes at this point only have two. Make use of this advantage to gain the upper hand. Late game In the late game, Julian needs to stack cooldown reduction to shorten the gap between his skill combos. Don't engage first and try to cast as many sets of combos as possible for maximum damage. For equipment, we recommend this build for sustained damage and survivability. For emblems, the Mage Emblem can be an optimal choice to further enhance Julian's cooldown reduction and damage capabilities. As for battle spells, Flicker is recommended for additional mobility and fault tolerance. Julian's arriving in the Land of Dawn on May 24th. Don't forget to trade in your exchange token and get him for free. With the release of the last member of the Forsaken Light Quad, the exclusive bonuses for the Forsaken Light heroes are also going live. The series will be added to the gallery, and by collecting all the four heroes, you can claim an exclusive avatar border on the gallery screen. There's also a special buff for this quad. When you play a Forsaken Light hero, you'll receive a small attribute boost for every other Forsaken Light hero on your team. Gather your friends now and join us in the Land of Dawn. We stand for one!